So guys, I'll do an intro and outro later. But guys, these are hair accessories and jewelry. Guys, these are so cool. You can use these on your doll hair or on your own hair. Are these big guys? I would use these on my own hair. We're in Target, by the way, guys. If I didn't say so. The next to clothes section. Oh, I like these for me. These would be cute for my dolls. I have a lot of stuff in dolls, because you guys didn't know. Oh, guys, I do have a new stuffed animal. I can't believe I've been here five years on this channel. It feels like it should be six, guys, because I used to have an old channel with my legal name. Which, my family is actually starting to urge me now, guys, that if I make a new channel, say just some crashes, I'm going to please don't use my legal name. Like, use my real legal name because there are creeps on here. I understand where you're coming from, but look at these sunglasses, guys. Guys, I love these hair clips. I don't have long hair anymore, but I love it. Everyone just says, wow, I just really just cut my hair. Like I always say, guys, I have what I call to be adopted aunts, like surrogate aunts in the neighborhood. Because my actual aunt lives out um, past um, Trasher, out past Hatboro. So my aunt and uncle live all the way out there. So I don't get to see my family too, too much. So it is nice to have surrogate family because I don't get to see my own that often. Plus... My other uncle lives on in Texas. I don't get to see him ever. So, guys, there's actually something we've been discussing, me and Dad. Guys, excuse that. You can see my toenails. I have not felt well enough to paint my toenails, guys. And there's something else that I need to address in a different video. Something that you guys have not been aware of that, you know what? It's time. I need to tell you guys. It's not right if I don't. So guys, look, I love these earrings. Like, these are a little big and gawky for my personal taste for a Halloween costume. Spot on. These are cute for everyday use. I have four in each year. If you guys want to see an all my piercings video, comment me down below. I don't like wearing too many hoops because I, I don't have... I have two lobes and two... I have two lobe piercings and two cartilage piercings. So I don't like... I don't wear hoops in my cartilage. And a fear but it would rip. I already had a piercing that got ripped out before. So cute, guys. I just love earrings so much. I used to talk to my brother about jewelry and makeup. My poor brother. I know I didn't have to talk about makeup. But you know what? I have got to talk about hair. Just dark. You said, I don't want to talk about makeup all the time, Gary. Makeup. So you talk about makeup hair. Because I tried to do my brother's hair one time when he was sleeping when we were younger. Yes, guys. I tried to do my brother's hair and put makeup on him. But he. I did it to dad, though. Dad didn't. Dad let me. <laughs> now he's younger, guys. My dad would let me put makeup and hair clips in his hair because I still love playing in his hair. His hair has thin now that he's 90, but. My mom used to do it in her sleep and she would not catch me. Guys, I love these big bags because I used to have my ears pierced a lot. I've had my ears pierced so many times, you guys. That people normally give me earrings and stuffed animals and dolls for birthday presents. Y'all, this one's missing. Don't put buy that one. But you know what, you guys? You guys might get these for a really adorable price. <laughs> and I have, I sometimes talk a little southern. Sometimes I talk to my little <laughs> woman. Um, guys, I like this stuff. It's so cool. Oh, you know what? I just fixed. You guys, I just fixed my earrings similar to this. I just had to put a new hook on them. I just haven't had a chance to show you guys me fixing. I didn't, video, I didn't film me fixing them. That was one of my hyenas. Yes. Yes, when I was sick. So I just wanted to get them fixed because I wanted to wear them. And then I just didn't wear them. These are oh, cool, but they're a little too big. My personal taste. Um, rings. I used to have a lot of rings. I still have a large uh, costume ring collection. I don't wear rings. I don't even wear my. I don't wear my ears pierced anymore. I am like polar opposite of younger me. 
I like these the only way I would wear them all together and all separate in my first piercings. And people I know always say they look so different these days. It's something different. I'm like, yeah. I cut my hair and my ears grew in. I didn't let them grow in, they, they, my piercings grew in. Yeah, guys, I don't feel like my normal self. I don't. The piercings made me me. It made me feel like the carrion that we all know. And you just don't feel like me anymore. So I was thinking about going to have my ears re pierced. And then you gotta fill all these forms. Because the place I used to get my ears pierced closed, you gotta fill all these forms out for like, if you have any STDs, which I don't. But you gotta fill out those forms. Well, I'm always getting embarrassed. I thought those were. Oh look, guys, little initial charm. I'm way too old for these. But I do have a C. First one is, ooh. I used to get the M charm. Um, remember my middle initial? People used to give me the M charm. Some people gave me a C, but a lot of people gave me an M charm because every woman, every woman in my family, almost a straight down generation, has an M starting first name. We all have M names for some reason. I was the only one who, you know. I mean, a straight direction down. But I can trace that. Did I show you guys this one over here? We just have, we're just assumed to have M first names. I probably will carry on the own tradition with my own future daughter. But who's the sis? Guys, some more jewelry over here. Let's pause. So guys, more jewelry stuff. You guys, I want to show you this. I would not recommend using these jewelry cleaners. Because if your jewelry is overlay of gold, this will strip the gold. I'm not saying this stuff is bad. Maybe, oh guys, this is open. Let me close it. So no poor person to spill them. I never, maybe I didn't use the instructions right, but it stripped the gold off my costume right. That meant for costume jewelry. I mean, do your own, do your own stuff, but still. I need a new pocketbook. My purse is getting old. I've only had it since school. Oh. I got it for Christmas. For around Christmas. I got a little Christmas present from my dad. Because my purse broke. Yes. The strap. You know, the strap of my purse broke. Um, look at this. Really cute stuff. So, guys, my hair isn't long anymore. So, I'm probably going to grow. I'm going to grow it back. But, I'm like, eh, my hair doesn't need to be long and stringy. Look cute. I'm going to look more mature. So guys, I didn't bring the other tablet because this one I thought was charging more than it was. We'll do intro and outro later on to both videos today. We will have, be having fun today, guys. Fourth of July. Boom, Fourth of July stuff, guys. I love the holiday stuff. Like I said, on my ears. They are pierced. Like I always said, for other ears are pierced. I want this clip because it's so cute and I missed out on getting some Patrick's Day one because I'm trying to get them a little cheap. Actually, guys, last year for Christmas I got a Force of July headband. I have hair pieces and stuff. Partner's going to top for that, too. I mean, <clears throat> come on, guys. Alright, guys, I have to cough. I want to do it on camera. Um, I love all the Force of July stuff. Like. <sighs> Guys, we also have a very big, I have a very big announcement to make that, it's, it's not in set in stone whether we're doing it or not though, but me and dad, like I said, for, I don't know if I said this on channel or not, but me and dad are thinking about moving. Oh God. I keep, I got something caught in my throat. Anyway guys, me and my father are thinking about moving. So, we don't know if we're actually going to move or we're just like thinking about it. Let's have the guys. We are the procrastinators. If you ever met me and dad, you know, we're the biggest procrastinators. It took us 23 years to move to my house. Like, that's how long it took us to move. Like, that was just in my lifetime he was waiting to move there. My uncle even tried to convince my dad. He was like, look, it's in my dad's name. I'll my dad's name right here for legal reasons. Like, look, you know, mom left you the house. Move into it. Like, I don't want to hear. Because at one point, guys, in another old neighborhood, I called my uncle and told him. The guy grabbed me at one point, which somebody did in the neighborhood, and my uncle went off. He told my father flat out, if I have to come all the way from Texas to move you to mom's house, he said, you, you know, I will do that. 
And then if me at the time, my aunt was still with us, okay, we will fly out here with my cousin who wasn't sick at the time. And he was like, because my cousin even went off when we found out. He was like, this is happening. Now that's why, guys, it finally happened again. And my uncle went off and said, you know what? I tried to get you to move to mom's house for so long that the neighborhood went rotten while you were waiting to move. Now my uncle says he wants this. He said, I should have just moved you guys to Texas with me. That's what my uncle said. You guys should just move to Texas after the fire. So when I called you guys and you said the house was burnt, you, no. You should have just moved after the fire to Texas or to Indiana to be with one of us. Was one of my brothers lives out in Indiana. He said, or he said, if you do get along with um, Bert, Rupert, he said, you should have moved to South Carolina, Rupert. He said, no. He said, one of the three of us would have taken you in, meaning my uncle meant between him or one of my, my, my actual brother and my biological brother. My biological brother wouldn't take me in, and I want nothing to do with him. Just the feeling's mutual. Um, so at the time that we were all sort of getting along, and he said, I really, guys, it's, it was just so, it was really so funny, sort of too, that my biological brother even said that he wanted to send for my dad to move with him because he doesn't want him to tell you. But that's like a whole story for a whole different day is that um, we were considering moving out of Philadelphia, but it's good, guys. We need a lot of work. We need a lot of help to do so. We have a house full of stuff for four generations of stuff. I love the earrings, guys, and the jewelry here. But I have so much. It's going to take a million years to move all of my stuff. So, you guys, I can't see the cream against the white. It's a little difficult for my eyes. If you guys are new to my channel, you guys don't know, I'm visually impaired. I don't know. I say it almost every video. I have a visual impairment. And see how it's like a gold color against the cream against the white? It's very difficult viewing through the camera for my eyes to pick up on. If you guys could see better here, let's see. Maybe I can make it a little brighter so you guys could see. But I'm pretty sure I just can't see because of my eyes. But I love this stuff, guys. It's so girly. Guys, this is too big for my taste. I like smaller jewelry. It's too... That first one's a little iffy, baby. That's way too big. Guys, I know no rights in the music playing in the background. Um, actually, guys, I gotta call some relatives. I haven't heard from anybody, and I'm like convinced everybody hates me now. Because, I mean, I'm the one who was sexually harassed. Ooh, that's something I didn't say on here before, guys. So, yeah, I don't want to touch on that too, too much, because that's not what this video is about. But that's why, guys, in the layman's terms, I have been really funny. I love these guys. Look at these. That's why I've been going for so long as well, is I have been sick. Emotionally sick. Can you pop, guys? Excuse me, I'm getting old. <laughs> How much are these, guys? $20? They're all so cute. I like to get my earrings to be able to wear home guys call. I like to be able to get all of my earrings where they all like, can go together. If I buy them together. Like these. I could wear these two. I like to wear stones in my lobes and like ballies like these in my cartilages. I can wear this in one. I can wear this in the other and then wear that in my second. And then put a pair of hoops. Because... I, I don't know, I just like wearing ballies in my cartilage. The stones in my hoop, and hoops and, and stones in my <clears throat> lobes. I used to have my ears pierced a lot, if you guys noticed. These are a little big. I mean, not for my cartilages, because I have ones that my friend gave me. Because she was a great friend. She just gave me because she couldn't use them. So she ripped the price off, so I how much she paid, and gave me a so thank you. I wrapped them up, put them under the Christmas tree. As a gift from her to me. Because she said I could have them at the point she gave them to me. So nice to still wear them. I think I might have them actually because it's not look hard. But I, should, I like to show you guys my jewelry. But my jewelry is not great. Speaking of jewelry, guys, I just found the, I have a bracelet and necklace for the show Supernatural. Okay, no, I'm not a fan. Them guys back in the day. So I have like jewelry to go along with it. I, I have weird nicknames and all this. So, guys, like I said, I can't see this very well because of the back. Like, this is a lot easier for my eyes to pick up on. Because the off gold color with the cream with the white. These are just like your average little hoops. You wear them in the first, the, the hoops, you wear them in the first pair of things. I've seen girls wear hoops like this in their seconds. I will never, you'll never see me wear. Oh, guys, these are even cute. 
I got but these in the first and maybe these in the seconds. I don't know. My ears appear sort of close together. Thanks to me. Because I pierced to my, my second ear, my second lobe myself. Well, guys, these are the kind I like to wear right here. They're tiny little delicate ones. I could wear these two in the first two. And then wear that one in my third. In my, um, in my cartilage. I do like to buy the earrings that have, like, all these on Look at these, so cute. That way I get extras and I don't have to worry. But listen, guys, I don't like wearing good jewelry because I lose things, I break things. Trust me, guys, the one time my father saved up, you know I talk about too much about good jewelry on this channel, saved up to buy me a nice pair of diamond earrings and I broke one and cried like a two-year-old. Um, They didn't have warranty on them, so we couldn't get them fixed. But, um... We did end up, my dad did end up re, 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 duplicating them for me for money, but he duplicated them for me. And one of my, my very weather friends, I guess, I had friends that were not good people, who had told me, why don't you just take the old set and pretend it's the original set and have it fixed? And when I told my dad that, my dad was like, we know, what do we think of that? My dad, that's, no, you're not doing that. That is, that is deceivery. I'm not doing that. And then my dad was like, what kind of a friend tells you to do that anyway? I was like, I don't know. Like, that's the kind of friends I used to have. But I do need to get that earring fixed because dad paid, I don't want to say how much my jewelry collection was, but dad paid eight, up to 50, over 50 for them earrings. Because they were on sale for Black Friday. See, guys, this is you got to come shop with me for Black Friday, you guys, because I know how to get good deals. People sometimes when they see me, they think, oh, we can take advantage of her that she's disabled. I get people go, oh, you know, you're disabled. They're like, they're nice to me because some people say they can't tell by looking at me. But in reality, guys, how can you not tell? My disability is in my eyes. So you could tell by looking at my eyes. But if you look everywhere else, you couldn't tell I have a disability because it's in, through my, it's in my eyes. So guys... It's getting a little... Whoa, guys, this video is way too long. We're going to speed this up here a little bit. Guys, look at these. This video is like almost 20 minutes long. No, 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 no. I like the kitty she ones. I like the tangles. No, guys. We're going to come back and do the dolls another time. But, guys, look. I always tell you guys, guys, this is what I need right here. I need period kicks. I'm sitting forever repairing broken busted up earrings. Hey guys, guys, we're gonna end this here because this video. Oh, sorry guys, that was my bad wrist. Okay, guys, intro, bye guys.